Good evening, family. News time. It is news time. We've got to look at the news because that is what's indicating what's going on. We know people are looking for a date and an hour and all the rest of it. No man knows the day, nor the hour. Certainly that's for the um, end of the tribulation. But we'll not go into that. I'm not into discuss pre-trib mid or anything in this one. It's just news, guys. And high alert, it's the US is on high alert as Kim Jong-un could reveal largest ever nuke missile this weekend for promising a big surprise for Donald Trump, after promising a big surprise for Donald Trump. I don't know how much of this is, is true. This is news pulled off many things. This is general news and could be fake news. Let's be honest about it. But it wouldn't surprise me at all. If, if that's what's going on. There's something... Do they, do they ever think they're going to win? Has anyone ever won a war? The only ones going back to winning wars and doing it right seem to be the Romans, didn't they? But we'll not go into that either. Just a short one tonight, just a news one. Because uh, I did promise I'd keep the news coming out. Draconoid meteor shower set to dazzle sky on Thursday night... Despite wet weather, this is UK except for the adverts. Um, it's it's except <laughs> despite the wet weather, we can't see this sort of thing in the UK. <laughs> it's just is always wet weather, you know. Doesn't anybody know? I can't get rid of them adverts. Sorry about that, but interesting one. I would love to see it. It looks fantastic, but I don't know whether that's an end time sign or not, but we know everything's moving around in the solar system and the asteroid belt and everything is potentially lining up. That's what we can say, isn't it? It's lining up. Um, it's all happening in with more intensity than it did before. But not when it comes to the Middle East peace plan or the peace plan or the biblical term for peace plan. It is happening. We, we Could there be another one? I hardly think so. Israel and Jordan sign historic airspace agreement. This is part of the peace plan. The deal allows flights crossing over one country to also fly over the other. So it's opening up as things, as people agree, within the territories of the peace plan. The peace plan. Israel and Jordan reach an agreement allowing flights to cross over both countries. Airspace, the transportation minister announced on Thursday, today. Uh, today's this video is. This will probably go out tomorrow. And I'll probably tell you tomorrow night did I see the meteor shower. But this is more like prophecy being fulfilled. In Ezekiel 38, 39, we see the Magog being mentioned. I do talk about it a lot because it's to be talked about a lot. But Russia is increasing its military presence in the Far East in response to rising tensions in a wider region, Defence Minister Sergei Shugu said on Thursday. Shugu, it's not how you, it's not how you pronounce it. They, they pronounce words rather strange in Russia, differently. In remarks cited on the Defence Ministry website, Shugu said reinforcements were being sent because the tension in the eastern strategic direction, referring to the area of encompassing Russia's eastern border with China and the wider Asia-Pacific. Sugi, Sugi did not specify that the new threats were or where the additional troops would go or where the additional troops would go. He promised 500 units of new and modernised equipment for the region as well as some improvements to the Navy, Navy's Northern Fleet. So it's moving in. It's moving in. I mean, has this ever happened before on such a grand scale where China is getting aggressive, Russia's moving arms in, uh, Iran is just wanting to sink everybody, the Middle East peace plan is done, Israel's gone past the 70 year. We're 70 to 80 years, aren't we? Uh, 10 years for stealth. Oh, 54 prophecies being fulfilled. What on earth? When, oh Lord, are you coming to take your bride? That's all I can say. 
Which leads me, before I go to the last piece of news tonight, that this is about the promotion of the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. This is the end times. This is the end time seasons. This is all showing up as prophecy said. Now is the time to believe in the Lord because there's only one that can get you out of what's coming. Only one. And that's Jesus. That if you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you are saved. You will be raptured before this. You will be raptured before it's coming in. If you don't understand what I'm talking about, go get yourself a Bible, online, digital, Bible gateway, whatever, and read Revelation or have it talky to you from six on. If you're seeing that happen, you're in tribulation. It will happen. I'm tired of saying it, to be honest. I think it's time the Lord come and got us. Or rather, I pray that the Lord would come and get us. It's not up to me to think anything. Mass death of sea life at Far East Russian tourist hotspot suffers complaint, complain of toxic burns. Sufferers complain of toxic burns. Hordes of sea creatures have washed up on the popular tourist beach of Kamacha after surfers complained about suffering from eye burns. A probe has been launched and tests show increased levels of petroleum products in the water. Increased, should there be any petroleum products in the water. Kamacha is a large peninsula of Russia's far east which juts out into the Pacific Ocean and Sea of Orsk. So it's, again, a sign that it's, everything's going on. I mean, it's happening so intense that we forget about the fires that are scorching the world. We forget about the plagues because there's so much coming out every day in the news. Every day. When do we have to stop watching? When do we have to stop, oh Lord? That's, that's what I say. Before I go any further, Discord. Discord is the only place I can send anybody to keep together. Please, guys, when you're in there, please keep together. It is difficult. We all have so many different opinions. The admin, administrators and, moder and moderators, what they say goes. What they say goes. If you're struggling to get in or get back in, then go to this video or consequent videos and use the later links to get back in, family, or, or in in the first place. Use the later ones. Don't go to the older videos. If your link isn't working and you're on an older video, come to the go to the channel, my channel, find a new video and, and come in there. But do come in. I will go back through the catalog and change the links back to where they were over time. If indeed we've got time brothers and sisters but i thank you all on on discord for working so hard some come some go but those that stay are doing the work of the lord and it's a very 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 difficult job holding 2500 people together please be leaning with each other please drop into other rooms if you've got a discussion please obey the moderators and above all remember it's in respect and edification of Father God. It is. I keep promising to do lives and I will do lives, but I need a setup to do this. Please let me know if you prefer this setup, seeing the news on, on screen, or would you prefer me doing it just as I do in the room? Um, we're having problems with YouTube, immense problems with YouTube. There is a link for a mailing list. Please put your name on it. There's no, you can unsubscribe from it any time you want. It's no catch. That is just to keep everyone together. There's a Patreon account in in there, in, in the description. And remember, use the Discord latest descriptions in the latest videos. We've sorted it out now. It'll never happen again. Um, I can assure you that. Letting people have control that shouldn't have control. But brothers and sisters, I will leave you with that and say may God bless you, keep you, make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you this day and always. God bless.